for that company. Uh, I'm in financial services. She got a bit twitchy, thought the markets might collapse, you know. Her shares would plummet. So I had the paperwork drawn up. She signed. Went off a free one. Happy. That's Larry. Let's clear region road. This is this is ridiculous. This is hang about. We fair like the handbag. Over. That was the price way back in January when you contacted me. I gave you a quote. I found quote. it. That's all it is. You know what the price? Hey, are you all right, mate? Come on, girls, calm down. <laughs> what? You're going to bash us with your handbag? Come on, Kerry. Hey, up. What's up, girls? No room at the inn. You don't recognise me without my handbag, do you? Oh, Tim. Don't tell me you two have been on the youth all afternoon. Pretty much. We reckon we're going to have to get a train over to Liverpool. Oh, steady on. Look, you couldn't recommend anything, could you? I mean, we, we don't mind roughing it a bit. Kipped on a beach in Thailand. As it happens, I do know a place. Cheap and cheerful, friendly locals, handy for the tram. Oh, look, you don't reckon you could give them a call and see if they've got any vacancies, do you? I'll do better than that. I'll take you there myself. Hop in. And I'll give you the guided tour. So, you see, the only house this side of the street with a fully operational garden. Liz, I am speechless. <laughs> the Hanging Gardens of Babylon. You really put them to shame, mate. So, uh, what do you think, girls? Shall we say 30 quid a night? What? Each. Each. <laughs> Shall we say there's a train to Liverpool at 10 to? 20 quid. 10. 15. Done. With breakfast. Oh, she's a tough nut, this one, isn't she? State judo champion, three years running. Oh, I'll have to watch my step then. Yeah, you will. My local watering hole, a hundred years old this year. Just mention my name and you'll be guaranteed a warm welcome. Martin! How are you, man? Oh, I'm great, Les, man. Hang on, what have you done? Hey? You! You look different. You brush your teeth or something? A wide range of beers and ales from around the globe, including some of your Aussie dishwater. <laughs> what can I get you? Anything you like? I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, no, look, uh, we want to unpack and stuff. Uh, have a bit of a mooch around, get our bearings in the daylight. Maybe tonight, then, eh? Yeah, maybe. Catch you later. Yeah, see you, girls. Oh, oh. You know what they are? They're ladettes. You read about them in the newspapers. They drink like men, they think like men, and they <laughs> like men. But they look... Quite normal, and they're obviously cracked. What do you mean? Two girls travelling on their own. One of them's a black belt at judo. <laughs> Fat lot of good that is when some loon's got a knife to your throat. What loon? Hey, are you talking about me? Well, you could be for all they know. <laughs> I'm amazed. Yeah, what amazes me is you've let them. I know. I mean, come on in, girls. Make yourselves at home. Hey, in fact, have a key. Oh, Northern hospitality. <laughs> Help yourself. Tea, toast, telly, video. Oh, and uh, have a look in your wallet while you're at it. <laughs> <laughs> Not them. Salt of the earth, them two. Yeah, let's, uh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you didn't hang around. I bet you've not even left a note. It's nothing personal, Les. Yeah, right. We just prefer clean sheets. It's three weeks worth of washing here. We thought we might as well chuck in the bedding as well. Washing? Yeah, we did draw the line at your jocks. You know, there's some cynical people around. You know that lot of the pub? Swines. They thought you were... Taking you to the cleaners. <laughs> right, these are really going to be edible. Um, Sodder. What are you just doing in here? Um, we're guests of Les from Australia. Are you Leanne? No, who's Leanne? I'm, I'm Jules, this is Kerry. Hey. Uh, Kirk. Sorry, it's just a way of in your... Hi. Well, we're here now, and we might as well enjoy the fact. Mini kebabs, everyone. How's the sausages doing? They'll be a while yet. You need a drink. Any more for any more? No. I bet it's like a little home from home. Oh, come on, you get in there. 
There were damsels in distress. I were the knight on a white charger. Oh, of course. You don't look much like damsels now. Nope. That Jules, she's like one of them Bond girls. Could break a man's neck with a bare thighs. So I figured it was a small sacrifice to make, giving up your bed. My bed? Play your cards right, and you could be back in it by Tuesday. Oh, so they're only stopping for three nights? You've got a lot to learn, grasshopper. That's a good job you're here then to teach me, master. Ah, so.